A question that I get a lot is how do I change my specific person? How do I make him prioritize me and pursue me more? Because right now I feel like I'm the one that is constantly reaching out to him and I don't hear from him for weeks if I don't reach out. Let's talk about it because some of you have no business even focusing on changing your specific person and the way that they're showing up for you if you haven't first looked at clearing the past. What I mean with this is that we cannot change how our specific person shows up. We cannot be affirming for the best version of our person if we're still holding on to that past pain, that past hurt, that resentment, anger, frustration based on how our specific person showed up in the past. If there's still this story in our mind and this nagging feeling in the body of how could you do this to me? How could you leave me like that? Don't you understand how much you hurt me? Those are the things we need to look at first so that we can let go of the past and all of those negative icky emotions attached to that past. Now we can start focusing on the future. Now we can start focusing on actually what we want to create, what we want to manifest and what, what kind of version of our specific person we want to have. Another way to put this is if we're still holding on to the past, we're still identifying as the old version of ourselves that got hurt, right? That got left, that got dumped. Then how are we expecting to see a different version of our specific person if we're still identifying as the old version of ourselves? It just doesn't work that way because everybody's you pushed out, meaning that your specific person is just a reflection of you, but they're not only ref a reflection of your self-concept or how you see yourself, like your belief system, they're also a reflection of your mental image that you hold of them. That's why inside my program, change your specific person in three weeks to get prioritized and pursued. We focus on changing the mental image of our specific person because that's really the, the thing that is manifesting that version of them. When your own brain, your subconscious mind holds onto an image in your mind of that person based on the things that happened in the past, based on your past experiences with them, like based on your past interactions with this person. And that is what's generating that version of your person.